Okay, so let's move on. We are through with uh, the 3D beam. Now we can move on to column and slab. But before I think this X vert and uh, rotate, I think it will be a common thing to three of them. Okay, so we can actually put it outside. We can put it outside the switch from where here. Okay. We will put it somewhere there so that it will happen for all of them. Okay, so we are still testing our 3D before reconciling it with the principle of our of our interface of our project. Okay, so let's go to slab now. So for slab, what will it be? Okay. This is a slab that we have to draw. This one is quite easy, right? So slab having the same principle. Slab is just a thickness, right? So we'll say h is equal to mm. uh, h is equal to j dot h times zero point zero one, right? And I think the length also is common to all of them. Okay, just that like in the case of in the case of uh, in the case of the column, it is the height. Okay, so we'll have to put it outside the switch. Good. So now here we are. So there's something we have to correct here. Okay, here will have to be our z axis according to what we've learned from uh, the beam part. Oh. To cut behave, come on, come on. What's wrong with this machine? Wasting my time, wasting my time. Okay, so here we have to be our z axis, and uh, here we'll have to be our y axis. Okay, here we have to be our y axis. So let's do that. So what are we going to have? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ah, we are on slab. So vert here, what will vert be equal to here? These are not one here again at the origin, so not one will be zero, zero, zero. Okay. Not two goes up a distance of h. Okay, so not two will be uh, what's that? Not two will be zero zero h. Okay, remember that's the z axis, and uh, not three. What will it be? Zero or uh, uh, no? Following the x, it is l x. Okay, and what is l x for us? It is l of l of one. Okay, you remember that our L for the case of slab is an array, a two element array. The first there is the X distance and the second is the, <laughs> the Z distance, right? Okay. <laughs> why am I laughing? I don't know why I'm laughing, right? So I have L of 1 there and uh, comma was Following y, I have 0, and then following z, I will have my h again. And then for the fourth one, for x, I will have l of 1 again. Okay. Then for y, I have 0, and for z, I have 0. Okay. So the other nodes behind are just a translation of this one again, like for the t. So I will just need to copy this and change every y, okay? So yes, translating following the y axis, I will change every y to L of to L of two, right? Every y, y which is second L of two, and here y to L of two. And here y to l of two. 
Good. So I think that will be that for vertices. Okay. It's long. But if we make a window bigger, it will be small. So again, fact will be equal to. So I'll start with the x y x z plane rather. Okay, that will be one two three four. So one two three four is one two four, right? And then uh, behind you will be five six seven. Come on, five six seven eight. Okay, so you'll be five two. 5 to 8. That will be behind. Then, next, I'm going to the YZ plane. YZ plane, I have 3, 4, 8, 7. Or, let me say 3, 7, 8, 4. Okay. 3, 7, 8, 4. Separated by commas. Okay. 3, 7, 8, 4. Then, I have... Two six five one two six five one okay then what next what next what next what next now the x y plane okay x y plane i have one five eight four one five eight four and then on top I have two six seven three two six seven three okay and I think for patch it is just the same function okay so so let's check whether we actually did this right okay hopefully we did. So we just have to change the case here to slab. You will understand why I'm doing all this thing, all this changing of case to that and that later. Okay, so there was a mistake somewhere. Let's go and check that. So what is it? Attempted to access L of two. Ooh, okay. So. So test this one properly, we need to initialize actually our, okay, we need to initialize it to our length element to a two element vector, okay, don't worry, we'll change it later. But for now, we need to actually initialize this to a tree tree, okay, that is the hoity toity. What is this? What's wrong here? Look at this scene. Cut dimensions cannot are not are not consistent. Take me there then. Oh. Eighty nine. Okay. Why are they telling me that cut dimension come here? Vertical concatenation. Have I forgotten something? Yes, I've forgotten something. Here it's supposed to be like that. And here it's supposed to be like that. Okay, to indicate the next line. Okay. Okay, so that's my slab. Okay. Good. So what's left now is just uh, our column, right? It's just our column. So the column will deal with it in the next video. Okay. But let me take advantage of this time just to explain the principle for the column. Okay. So this is our column here. And you see that the column is a cylinder. Okay. Obviously, we need to change uh, the z here to to x to y rather. Sorry, to y, and then the up direction will be z. Okay. Will be z. So what happens? 
here our x y plane is supposed to be a cylindrical coordinate okay that's how the points are indicated when it says cylindrical coordinates it means the points are in a different kind of reference point okay so if i'm to say this is my circle for example let me try to represent something here okay come on where's the center 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 you're not giving me the center boy this thing activated or not why is this circle not reacting to me okay oh i did not click online sorry sorry what am i doing so normally from what i've drawn there okay Normally, from what I've drawn, this is my my reference point here. Okay, that's what you see here. Okay, so here we represent the x-axis, and here represents the y-axis. So this circle can be the circle that is down here. The origin is taken from from the center of the circle. Okay, so what will it mean to have? Uh, what will it mean to have? Uh, what am I talking about? To have a cylindrical coordinate, I don't think I'll have time to explain this in this particular. Okay, I will not have time. So we'll just deal with column in the next video. Okay, thank you very much.